I mean, you've come a long way in your career. How does it, you know, what does it mean to, to be working in the fashion industry from Cyprus or in Cyprus? I mean, is, is, this, is this a challenge? Is this a, a burden? Is it a blessing? I mean, you know. <laughs> a bit of all, I guess, because um, Cyprus is a small market, a very small market. So your opportunities to get really big are not that much. I mean, business-wise, I mean, I'm talking sales-wise, because apart from what you love, you have to live off it. But um, I was lucky enough or blessed enough to uh, participate in a lot of worldwide um, fashion fairs. So I had a lot of uh, presence in other countries abroad as well, my collections. And that was beautiful because I liked the fact that Ocean Blue traveled across the borders of this small island. And it was lovely because so many years ago, a lot of people didn't even know Cyprus. So it was amazing to actually get the opportunity to talk about the small Mediterranean island which was divided in two. And uh, people were actually intrigued. And that was something beautiful. Mm -hmm. And then on an international scale, I mean, you made it to Harper's Bazaar at some point. Was that a peak in your career? Um, it was a highlight of my career. It was, um, it was an honor that I did the cover on Harvest Bazaar, uh, but um, also when I was awarded the Madame Figaro Award Designer of the Year because it came from the people, the, like the people voted. So I think to me the highlight is when women come to me and say how much they love my clothes and when they wear them it makes them feel beautiful because I think for every designer that's the reward to feel that other women love your collections and they wear them and it makes them feel beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, and you were the first Cypriot also. I mean, you were representing um, the first Cypriot, the first woman from Cyprus perhaps to, to reach these levels. I don't know about that, but um, as I said, I, I felt blessed enough. I was also very hardworking and I also think luck is also important in life. So a mixture of all these ingredients uh, gave me a beautiful journey and still are. <laughs> okay. Um, you're also, if I'm not mistaken, I don't have it written here, but you're, um, aren't you part of an association here? Yes, the Fashion Designers Association. I'm the vice president. Um, so that's something which is nice that we see it growing because there are a lot of designers nowadays and this is beautiful because you see a lot of new talents and it's great because I think Cyprus have also shifted a bit um, their mentality and they started supporting more and more the Cypriot designers which is great because we're coming from the same island, we're on the same team so it's good to support locals.